University of Port Harcourt. Enlightenment and self-reliance. That is the motto of the school which seeks to promote knowledge in science, arts and entrepreneurship. The university has three major campuses known as Unipark or Abuja Campus, Choba Park as well as Delta Park and has a serene environment which promotes serious academic work. This serenity equally encourages arts. Since the establishment of the university in 1975, it has contributed immensely towards national development through its multidisciplinary nature. Courses are designed to equip students in theory and practice. The Faculty of Humanities, which happens to be the first faculty in the university, is not left out towards ensuring that its courses equip students in both theory and practice. THA 100.1, Fundamentals of Theater Arts, a faculty-based course explicates these assertions. THA 100.1 is a course domiciled in the Department of Theatre and Film Studies. However, it is offered by other departments in the faculty, such as Linguistics and Communication Studies, Religious and Cultural Studies, History and Diplomatic Studies, Foreign Languages and Literature, English Studies, Educational Foundation, and others. THA 100.1, popularly known as the Festival of Plays, was made prominent by Professor Henry Leopold Belgam, who set its current methodology in 1982. Left the University of Jos to the University of Port in 1982 as a lecturer too. And uh, when I reported to the then head of the department, Professor Larutin, uh, he assigned me a course, a course titled uh, Fundamentals of Theatre Arts. Then it was C. Aruti 100.1. It was here, Ruti, because then we had the Department of Creative Arts, which housed theatre, arts, fine arts, of music. But then, m music was not functioning. What was functioning were, were just the, the drama aspect, the theatre aspect, and the, the fine arts the department. So he assigned a, that course to me. It was a foundation course, embracing the whole faculty. So when I entered that class the first day, I saw the number of students. Uh, there were about 200, 200 and something, you know? So I thought I introduced myself that day and uh, told them we were going to work as a team. The students uh, now divided the students into groups. Group one to up to group, to up to group ten, and ask them to choose whatever plays they liked. I also created a group that had to do with with choral, dance group, mime group, and all that. So we divide, divided them into various groups, and they started work.
was going around and letting it grow. But it was tedious. So and I hinted him that we are going to involve other lecturers, let other lecturers participate as supervisors, even teach them aspects of theatre. That was done. And then when the exam, you know, came, I invited a lot of people to come and watch the festival. And they wrote to the then vice chancellor, the vice chancellor who was there when I was head of the department, to come and watch the festival. So I tagged it that hundred festival of plays. People were coming from town. In fact, it was an example. It was an open show for everybody. People were coming from town, from Choba, from Portacourt City. When the VC came and launched it, I think he gave us a sum of six six thousand naira. Name of the VC who declared it an annual festival, who gave us that honorarium was Professor Kelsey Harrison. Action! The theoretical and practical aspects of the course starts after the students have registered for the course. Thereafter, students attend classes during which they are divided into several groups. The head of department, Professor Femi Shaka, identifies the core values of the course and its import to students. The THA 100.1 course it's a faculty course. Um, it is called Introduction to Theater and uh, Film Studies. Um, the whole um, background for the introduction of that course is that we want students from other departments within the faculty to have an idea of uh, what we do in the Department of Theatre and Film Studies. In terms of performance, in terms of history, in terms of uh, theory and criticism, in terms of um, uh, things that have to do in the area of film, for instance, production, in terms of documentation and so on and so forth. It's just to introduce them to um, the performing arts as well as film as a discipline so that when they go back to their own departments they will have a fuller understanding a fuller understanding of what we do or what we teach our students in the department of theater and film studies so if you look at how the course is structured there is a history component that introduced students to the history of uh, Nigerian theater, uh, the, to the history of Nigerian cinema. It introduces them to issues that has to do with uh, literature in that they study plays. And then it introduces students to the area of acting and directing uh, in that somewhere along the line, all the students in the course are divided into groups and those groups have group leaders they have directors stage managers all the performing arms of uh, the theater are represented and of course lecturers are made to uh, to supervise the productions so that at the end of the day they will have a fuller picture a fuller picture of what we do as a department of uh, so, student, any student who uh, have passed through the faculty. Most of them later in life boast, oh, that uh, they took the course uh, to 100. Uh, when anybody says they took the course to 100, it's like a watershed in their life. Because that is when 
they really understand and are able to appreciate what you know kind of training the movie stars, their favorite movie stars that they watch, you know, in, in, in films, the kind of training that prepared them for what they are doing currently. Come here, come here. <laughs> Rehearsal of different plays, choral and poetic dramatization commence immediately the groups are shared. All these groups which have different lecturers as supervisors have a central coordinator who ensures the smooth running of the theoretical and practical aspects of the cause. Festival of Plays is all about the practical component of the course TA 100.1, otherwise called Fundamentals of the Arts of Theatre and Film Studies. We are the first year students in Theatre and Film Studies would gather to showcase the talents uh, they have brought to the discipline they have come to learn. For a few months now, they have been in the classroom. Different lecturers have taught them the arts of the theatre and they are coming to let the world see that they are interested in the course. They want to see how they can harness their hobbies, their talents, and the impact the lectures are making on them together. Uh, personally, I, I enjoy being assigned to coordinate this course. We are trying to introduce some innovations in this year's festival of plays. Uh, number one, we are having a documentary to keep a record track of what is being done. We are also introducing for the first time the use of CBT and their theoretical examination. I feel good. I feel privileged. I feel honored to undertake this assignment. It's something that gladdens the heart to see young stars coming up, going to the stage to display what God has bequeathed them with. It's noble to think that Nollywood has a future in our students. It's amazing to see that young boys and girls come to theater and film studies with bundles of talents and hobbies. Satoni Japong equally highlights the operational methodology of the course. Students are actually rehearsing towards this examination and we have about 22 groups here who are actually treating different aspects of the program. We have the play test, we have portrait dramatization, and we have chorus. And very soon we are going to have our practical exams, which will soon start from 1st June to 6th of June. Four groups will definitely perform a day. We start at 4 p.m. and end at 8.30 p.m. And we have examiners, two examiners a day to take care of these performances. Then, then the viewers are there will be the judge. So you push yourself. I hope they have angelic voices though. Just listen, you will be the judge and their mother and father will be the judge. <laughs> <laughs> now. 
This time, the theory exams will take a different turn altogether. RCTC personnel will come in, and therefore we expect all our students to register so that their names can be forwarded to that unit to start their bit of the program. Supervisors of various groups equally share their experiences and challenges in the program. It's actually been a very wonderful experience. In group, in group 20, we have students from different departments. We are one of the few groups that have little of theater arts students. However, we witness that the, there is a strong and two sizes on the side of the students. So their performance so far has been wonderful. There is a sense of commitment that is desired for a wonderful production. The attendance has been encouraging and the students too have enjoyed being part of the 100. Um, we are looking at uh, a very wonderful production in spite of the challenges we have at hand. We are hoping that our production is going to be wonderful. It's going to um, bring a lot of joy to the students at large and to the department in particular. So um, I am really happy to be a supervisor to such a group. What we're doing is basically Kura, and we're working on the theme of peace and unity. And we're looking at the Nigerian society and trying to see how we can use chorus and series of uh, Kura rendition to bring about the desired national unity that we're looking, at, looking out for. So I'm very optimistic that at the end of the day it's going to be a wonderful production. Thank you very much. Putting up a theatre production is quite a daunting task. However, students learn a lot in the rehearsal process. My name is Israel Wininda and I'm, I'm level 100 and um, I am I am in the Department of Theatre Arts, level 100, and I'm a director, and I am um, the team, um, I'm a director and the team of our uh, group, which is group 20, is uh, Coral, the team of the group, um, team of the group is Peace and Unity. What are the challenges that your group is facing? Um, for now, we have some challenges um, we are facing. Like in the aspect of the costumes, our costumes are not yet ready, and although we are working on them. Oh, it's a bit thing for me because this is the first time I'm coming. I'm doing anything on stage and Working with so many people like this, it's a little bit difficult, but I'm getting used to it. And my role, though, I'm acting as um, and how, um, the house girl coming from the stream, and all of a sudden, mistake or by mistake, someone shot me and I died, so, which caused a lot of problems and all that. Okay, what are the challenges the group are having? Are they being cooperative? Because um, they're getting used to group, we're getting used to getting along with each other, different people, different attitudes and well. All right, thank you. My name is uh, Michael Dima Okumba, and I'm an 100 level student, English studies. And um, this is group 20, and uh, it's a choral group, and I'm the music director in this group. And um, it's not really easy working with we humans though, but we're trying our best to make sure we get good grades and come out excellent and with flying colors. How has it been directing the choral? Like I said, it has not been really easy 
working with us human beings it's very difficult but we're progressing by the grace of god and with time we'll get to perfect what we're doing here all right thank you very much okay. all right my name is evangeline chisom emibia i'm the department of theater arts and film studies my role in the choral play is i'm the hunter hunter's friend that was killed as a revenge of the who the hunter killed. So that was my role in the play. As challenging as the rehearsal process can be, one wonders what productions will be churned out. Join us as we take you through this artistic experience coming from months of preparation.
of Nollywood stars trained under this same roof. The CRAB, an acronym for Creative Review of Arts and Books. Behold the leaders of tomorrow, stars that will keep the thespian flag flying. The leader, the leader will...